This morning we are talking about new advances in eye surgery and Bridget is here with some new options for mm -hmm. people like me That's right. with vision issues. <laughs> That's right, Sandra. We've all heard about LASIK. Now there are some other developments when it comes to vision correction. Eye surgeon Dr. Sandy T. Feldman from Clearview is here this morning with the latest technology. Good morning. Good morning. First of all, tell us about the newest advancements. There are wonderful new exciting advancements for permanent vision correction and they involve the use of implants. We've all heard about LASIK, and now we have the implantable columnar lens known as the ICL. Mm -hmm. That's good for people with, with nearsightedness. We also, as we begin to get in our 40s, yeah. begin to have trouble up close. Yeah. And our arms suddenly aren't long enough. <laughs> There's also yes. implants that are wonderful for those people as well. Okay, so this is different than LASIK. How so? Well, in LASIK, we use an all-laser method to reshape the front surface of the eye, known as the cornea. In these implant technologies, what we do is insert tiny little lenses, almost like contact lenses, into the eye, mm -hmm. and we don't remove any tissue. Okay, but there, there are ideal candidates for this. Absolutely. Ideal candidates for this, for the ICL, are people between the age of 20 and 40 who are nearsighted. People above the age of 40, when you're beginning to experience that condition we call presbyopia, right. for them, other implants known as the multifocal implants mm -hmm. or accommodative implants are great options for them. This is so exciting. We want to show some pictures. We have the procedure right here. Tell us about how it works. It's pretty quick, I understand. It's absolutely quick. Well, in this procedure, what we're doing here is just making small little holes in the iris with a little laser procedure. We're putting eye drops, mm -hmm. numbing eye drops in the eye, make a small teeny incision under a microso microscope, and insert a little implant inside the eye. So and you can here's see the there's the natural lens. Mm -hmm. We're going to make a small incision, and through that, we're inserting that ICL. It sits just in front of our natural lens and enables people to be less dependent on glasses for people who are nearsighted and can't see up close, can't see in the distance. That's fantastic. So you can also use an implant to treat cataracts as well, is that correct? Ex exactly. Mm -hmm. So there's different type of implants which are very similar, which are used to treat cataracts. But instead of going in front of the natural lens, they go where our natural lens was previously. And now, how much does a procedure like this cost? These procedures cost between about twelve fifty or three thousand dollars per eye. There, it's no more. It's very affordable. No more than a latte a day yeah. with our excellent no interest <laughs> financing plans. <laughs> All right, Dr. Feldman, we appreciate it very much. Great new technology that'll clear things up for a lot of people. Great talking to you today. Wonderful.